In-ear monitors such as these KZZS10 Pros sound great, but lack the convenience of wireless Bluetooth. For about $26, these ear hooks make IEMs wireless. Best of both worlds. Hi, this is David of Techfobaba, a channel I share my experiences on how technology enhances my time with kids and family as a dad. If this is your first time here, welcome. Please consider subscribing to the channel. In today's video, let's unbox and check out these Bluetooth ear hooks for KZ IEMs. See if they can indeed add the convenience of wireless Bluetooth without adding too much latency and sacrificing too much sound quality. The model I have here is the KZ AZ09. Let's see what comes in the box. A case with the ear hooks inside. An USB-A to USB-C cable for charging. And a manual in Chinese and English. The quality of the case is surprisingly good. It's made of hard plastic, matted black with a KZ logo on the top. It's about 8 centimeters or 3 inches by 7 centimeters. And 3.5 centimeters thick. Much bigger than the AirPods Pro case. There is a big indicator light in the front and a an USB-C port for charging on the side. The cover is held closed by magnets. Very nice. When the case is opened, the ear hooks are ready to pair and shows up on the Bluetooth menu of my phone. The battery on the ear hooks lasts about 5 to 6 hours depending on listening mode and volume. The case has an 800 mAh battery, which can charge the ear hooks 7 times for up to 42 hours of listening. More than enough. To make them fit better in the case, the left ear hook is on the right, and the right ear hook is on the left. It's good that they're labeled to avoid confusion. The ear hooks are also held down in the case by magnets. Very elegant. Each one has a stiff curve behind the ear hook with the C-pin connector. There's a black plastic housing for the battery and a control button towards the tip. In the back of the ear hook, there are a couple of charging contacts. Let's put the IEMs on. The ear hook connects to the earbuds just like a wire would. These ear hooks will work with IEMs using the C-pin connector. There's also a B-pin connector version for the same price. The ear hook weights only about 4.5 grams each, so they're very comfortable to wear. They're well balanced behind my ears, so I hardly notice they're there. Oh, and there's a big cavity at the center of the case for earbuds connected to the ear hooks to all fit in the case. It's even padded with soft sponge to protect the earbuds. They're oriented in such a way that the nice face plates are displayed on the top. Again, a very nice case for the price. So how do they sound? Surprisingly okay. If I listen very carefully, the sound is not as crisp and clear due to the Bluetooth compression, which is expected, but the sound profile has not changed much. Good enough for casual listening when the wireless convenience is needed. The connection is stable for the most part. The range is quite good too. I can walk into the next room without losing connection. The controls work well too. One click to play and pause the music, or pick up or hang up a call. Double click on the left to go back a song. Double click on the right to skip to the next song. Long press to start Siri. Three clicks to switch between standard and low latency modes. Latency in the standard mode is noticeable, but not a big deal when listening to music. But for gaming or watching videos, I switch over to the low latency mode. The ear hook also comes with the mic. Let's switch over to it and see how it sounds. This is what the KZAZ09 mic sounds like. How does it sound? Let me know in the comment section below. For just $26, AZ09 does exactly what it's meant to do. These ear hooks turn my wire IEMs into truly wireless Bluetooth earbuds, similar to the AirPods. For just $26, they give me the best of both worlds. Use the ear hooks for wireless convenience and switch back to wires for better sound. For about $20 more, there are two upgraded models, AZ09 Pro, 
which offers Apex support and stronger connection with the Qualcomm chip, an AZ10, which also supports Apex, adds spatial audio, and a bit larger battery. I'll have links to all of them in the description below if you want to check them out. Thanks for watching. If you find any part of this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Are there other Bluetooth ear hooks you recommend? Please let me know in the comment section below. If you want to see more videos on how technology can enhance our life with kids and family, please subscribe and turn on the bell to be notified when I put out my next video. I'll see you in the next one. Until then, remember to cherish each moment.